please go after the wizard one. Oh, go after the wizard one. Please, ah. Jesus. <laughs> okay, okay, this time for sure. This time for sure. There we are. Get away from me, you fucking wizard. Get the fuck away. Ooh, ooh, stealth mode activate. Healing. Foos! <laughs> I look out from behind my cover. Foos! <laughs> foos at you! I foos at you! Foos, foos! <laughs> foos, foos! <laughs> Ow, shit, no! <laughs>When we had last left the prisoner bound by prophecy, they were in the small town of Iverstead and made plans to travel further east to the city of Riften. However, a few strange things came into play and interrupted their fascinating, fun jaunt through the woods. Yes, Iverstead was filled with terror and horror. A poor dude named Narfi was missing someone named Rada, and so too was there a barrow nearby, just outside of the town's uh, perimeter. A barrow filled with a ghost, and it turned out that that ghost was no ghost at all, but a stupid guy, and that guy got killed. <laughs> it turned out that there was also a secret dragon claw door, and upon saying that they had rid the ghost from that barrow, the town of Iverstead, its innkeeper, awarded the prisoner a fantastic and dope-looking sapphire dragon claw, a dragon claw that would lead them deeper into the lower levels of the barrow, the lower levels that contain not just additional treasures, but additional danger as well. This is the Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. Welcome back! Sven's here too. <laughs> He's looking at these dead bots. Did we already loot all their garbage? Yeah, we did. We totally did. We got it. We got it. Let's do a quick save just in case we get obliterated here out of nowhere. We're looking good. We'll have to carefully avoid this. Oh, look. What is this? Oh, it's an embalming tool. I always see them and think that, hey, that might be a lockpick, but they aren't. Sven? Please don't crush us. Great, thank goodness. Uh-oh. There's a freaky dude here. Here we are. Let's get our own freaky dude out. Oh shit. Jeez. Look at him blasting our friend. Look at that blast happen. Oh god. Foos! Man, the foos is... I need to work on the foos timing here. Oh, nope, not enough magicka. Fair enough, tried to get two of them. All right, got an iron shield and another one. Oh, Shroud Hearth Barrow's Key. Yo, dope. Okay, let's heal ourselves up a bit. Iron door, expert lock. Hopefully we have the key and that's exactly what we found. Oh look, some more stupid tools here. Weird that they decided to just leave all the embalming tools in here, you know? <laughs> <laughs> they, <laughs> like, apparently, getting involved was, like, the hottest fucking trend to do in Skyrim land for the longest damn time. And you would think that so many embalmers would exist and want to preserve their tools, but they were just like, nah, just bury my tools just as well. I don't give a shit. <laughs> just keep them in there with all the dead people. I'm sure that'll be fine. They'll never, never come back to life. <laughs> they did too good with the embalming. Wow, look at this huge-ass place. Wow, this place is titanic! This fucking barrow is bigger than the actual village! Where did all these people fucking come from? Was Iverstead like once an immense town or what? Yo! Okay. Ooh, what's this? Ooh, it's like a greater soul gem? Oh my god, look at that, it is. Got some linen wraps as well, hide bracers. Not worth taking. Are there any undead beings around here? Probably. Let's see, there's a nice, fun little stream. Oh my gosh, it's so relaxing. So calming. You love to go inside of- Oh look, is that a treasure chest or just a peculiar rock? It is a peculiar rock. But you love to go inside of the creepy undead barrow where all of your relatives are buried and shit. And you love to go up in there and just relax. <laughs> oh look, a dwarven sword. Huh. I mean, I can technically take that. I guess we will. Right? 
Okay, let's head on up here. There'll be something easy that we can drop if we need to. Let's do a quick save again. I bet we need to lower that bridge somehow. Oh, look at this. It's a freaky button. Okay. Everything's coming up snake. Huh. How do I figure out the solution? Oh dear. Uh-oh. There's some monster man inside? Oh, I can just open this. Uh-oh! There's the monster man! Shit. I hit Sven with the soul trap. Is there any others or just this one? Okay, we can fuck with one. I'm on your side. Foos! There we are, Foostum. I wonder what happens if I activate this trap. I'm going for it! What did it do? I don't know, it looks like it just rocked over a big wall. Let's get out our Atronach. Nope, we can't. Not yet. There we are. Come on, Sven. Steadfast there, Sven. It's talking about Croesus. There we are. Good. Bash him. Keep him bashed. Look at us leveling up our ship. We're already at level 54, one armed or one handed. There we are. Foosome. Eat shit, dude. Look, we can get out our friend. We can maybe do a soul trap. Nope. Knock him. The good thing about that Atronach is that it has the the point blank AOE dot. Okay. Draugr White. Nothing on him. Is there a secret within? Oh shit, this is a secret zone. Look at that. Snake. Okay. Well, this one is already snake, isn't it? Let's see. Can I move this bod? Yes, I can. Okay, so here are the arrows that denote what they are pointing at. Okay. Good. How's my health? Do I need to top myself off? Nah, we're fine. Alright. Let's just shield up, because we're going to have to solve this puzzle, aren't we? Let's do a quick save. Grab some money. Anything in this? Ooh, an amethyst ring. A silver one. Okay. Hmm. Search this urn. Good. Alright. A little magic, a little bit of money. Give me some money, too. You think one of them is gonna have a freaky dude? Oh, look! It consistently rotates. Oh, Shazbot. Fish. Okay. So let's set this one up to be fish. And then, there we go. Great. And let's do it again. What are these? Bird. There we are. It's probably a hawk, right? My first inclination is to say eagle, but I don't know how plentiful eagles are in Skyrim land, right? I think hawks and shit are way more plentiful. And what do we have over here? Fish! There we are. Ah, the pale chub. And push it. Boom! Oh my gosh, open the way for me. Anything else good in here? Look, that's actually a secret little path. Whoa, there's something up there. Oh shit, is that a lever right there? Hold up, can you make that out? Oh, never mind, that's just some weird shit. Part of the scaffolding. Oh, I'm hungry. Okay. Let's eat. Let's chow down on some garbage. Rabbit haunch. Yum, yum, yum. Oh, pardon me, Sven. Here we are. Okay. Let's see. We've got this cool little chair. Ooh, our alteration went up. Does it keep going up while we're in combat with an alteration effect active? Similar to Conjuration? I guess so. Oh shit. Look at us. We're leveling everything. Alright. Let's fucking go, dude. Whoa! Shit! What even activated it? Sven, was that you? <gasps> Oh shit, it's a boulder zone! Boost it! Ooh! Wow, he got crushed majorly. <laughs> what an idiot! Oh god, who put a whole bunch of fucking boulders like this in their <laughs> in their ancestral tomb? What the hell? Okay. Bone meal. I guess I'll take it. Man, you know, we thought that like Dunmer had some pretty wild ass uh, burial zones and shit. 
But I think the Nords fucking got them beat. <laughs> they just decided to, like, turn this into some mousetrap shit. Fuck. Oh my god. Do not pass go. Let's turn this on. Check in here. A silver garnet ring. Should we check out this fun little door? I bet there's some goodies inside. Let's see. Oh shit. Okay. Oh, Shazbot. At least we have plenty of picks. There we are. And the silver lining is picks do have weight. They weigh 0.1 units each. So, you know what? Breaking one, it doesn't make me all that... Ooh! Thought that, that little nipple was about to squirt me. Oh, a golden ingot. Okay. Looks like an Indiana Jones situation. Okay. Toss me the whip, Sven. Yoink! <laughs> cool. Alright. Should I put something there? I could put, like, a steel dagger there. You think that carries more weight than an ingot? I don't think so. Wow, I think it does? Ooh! Shit. I have no idea how to operate this thing. I did it! <laughs> Close enough, Sven! Let's get the fuck out of there. <laughs> okay, cool. Where is the button? Oh, there it is! Okay, because we may need to make use of that, right? That button could be very useful. We checked this dude, right? Yeah. Good, good, good. Look at that. What a bunch of freaks. Let's enter stealth mode. Stealth mode activate, baby. What do we have in here? Minor stamina. A long bow. Picture of a fun looking guy. Looks kind of like some screaming Ewok at the top. What the fuck? Is it just me or does that look kind of like an Ewok? Like an extra hairy Ewok raccoon? Yeah, it looks more like a raccoon. What? Am I tripping balls or does that up there look like a fucking raccoon with like really furry cheeks? Look, it's even got little paws. That is a raccoon. What the fuck? What does this even mean? What? The raccoon god. Oh, I love it. Okay. <laughs> sure. Great. <laughs> Anything else around here? No, I think we're fine. Does this go into another section? Ooh, the depths. Shroud heart, hearth depths. Depths. <laughs> we're doing great. <laughs> okay. Anything over here? Ooh. Plentiful healing. Good shit. Okay. Well, now we can't make use of that trap. And honestly, this looks like a place where we might need to. <gasps> Look at this intimidating fucking room. Jeez, it even plays an ominous sound. Okay, let's send our friend out. Here you go. Uh oh. I don't think I like where this is going. Me neither, dude. Look at all these fellas, skeletons. Okay. Oh shit. Please don't snipe me. Uh oh. Oh fuck. You damn ass. Where are the rest? Huh. Can't swing and jump at the same time either. Good to know. Okay, how do I get up to these fucking dudes? Uh, I'm going over. Let's do it. Yeah, that's right. I'll run up to you, you dumbass. Uh, knock you down. Slash you with a sword. I don't know how good it is. Alright, down this way. Good, good, good. Shit, I should search this one, because it'll be hard to uncover. We got more assholes popping out. Sounds like Draugr this time. Yep, restless ones. Good. Oh, shit! Let's get some of that out. Oh, fuck! I need food. <laughs> or healing. I need something. Put it in me. Activate that. Good. Let's see... Get some of that, so we can just survive this. No! Wow, it wasn't enough. It was not enough. Okay, we have to be very careful here. Oh, Shazbot. Okay. Let's see, get another friend out. I need you on the <gasps> Wizard Lord. Jesus, look at this guy's blast. No, Sven is trapped outside. No wonder he's not in here. It's just me against them. Okay, fuck it. Foof! Foof him. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Oh, 
All right, let's go back. Woo, 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 woo. Please yeah. go after the wizard one. Oh, go after the wizard one. Please, ah. Jesus. <laughs> okay, okay, this time for sure. This time for sure. There we are. Yeah. Get away from me, you fucking wizard. Get the fuck away. Ooh, ooh, stealth mode activate. Healing. Foos! <laughs> I look out from behind my cover. Foos! <laughs> foos at you! I foos at you! Foos, foos! <laughs> foos, foos! <laughs> oh, shit! No! <laughs> he did not give a shit. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. There it is. Good. I'm gonna foos ya! Oh, I'm gonna foos ya. Okay. We don't need to foos them. Foos! All right, now we do. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, you dick. They double teamed. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> wow, that was a freaky looking dragon right there. All right. Let's go on up here. Foos! Foos? Oh. There we are. Good. Jeez, my shit is so slow. Ah! Oh, there we are. Foosome. Great. How's its health? <laughs> Do I dare go in? Let's dare to go in. Almost. Oh yes. Hero zone, baby. Who's next? Shit. Is it the big boss? Uh oh. It is. Okay, let's hide out over here and recuperate a bit before we take on the next challenge. Let's do a quick save as well. Maybe I can even wait. No, <laughs> I can wait here for an hour. <laughs> Good to know. We'll do it if we need to. All right. Look, I'm in such a, I'm in like a Morrowind mode. <laughs> like early game Morrowind, just like, all right, we just killed some. Let's wait an hour. Heal up, baby. <laughs> all right. Yeah, that's right. This is the... This is that fantastic, finely tuned over ages, eras, and millennia, the Dunmer fighting technique. Kill one dude, wait like 50 hours. <laughs> A tried and true method. Okay. Taught to me by my Dunmeri ancestors. Good, good, good. Okay. Let's see. What have you got? Amethyst. I'll yoink that. What have you got? Iron Shield. It's Garbo. Okay. Wow. They're like falling all over the damn place. Do you hear them? Where did it go to? Oh, there's- there it is on the left. Do you see it? Let's sneak up. Let's check this... Draugr. Nothing. Skeleton, maybe? Nothing. I don't like that noise. Is that like a body bobbing up and down in the water? Look at this asshole. Uh-oh. Yoink! There you go. Get him, dude! Get him, Francine! Get him! I'm gonna steal its soul! Good. Whew! Is this one open yet? No, it's not. Uh-oh. Okay. Let's be careful here. Foos you. Slash him up. Good. Okay. Uh-oh. Is Big Bubba coming out? Not yet. Let's take out this dude quickly. Boom! Dispatched. Let's do a quick save. Foos you! Foos you! Foos you, you fooser! <laughs> okay. Uh, our friend Francine is having difficulties. All right. We're fine, though. Because so too is this asshole having difficulty. Uh oh. Francine is gone. Uh oh. Foos! Oh jeez. Okay. Yeah. Ah! Can I get another fiery friend? Uh oh. <laughs> shit! Some Scooby Doo shit, huh? All right. Good time to quick save. Let's unload on him. 
All right. Good. Jeez, you ass. No! Shit! All right. Again, we can get him. We can totally get him. There we are. Oh my gosh. Sometimes this interrupt does not take. What is up with that? It does not connect. Oh, shit. All right. Am I, like, trying to do a power bash or something? Do I even have that unlocked? Let's see. Maybe I am. Maybe that's the problem. Foof! Foosome! There we are. Good. Yeah, that point-blank AoE is really excellent, isn't it? Uh-oh. There we are. Man, one-handed is going through the roof. Okay. Big boss. Oh shit, it's the Overlord. Does he know magic? Oh! He foosed me! Oh, he just gave me a Roda. Okay. Oh, fuck you, dude. Oh, get the fuck back! Whoa, shit! Had like a delay. Okay. Let's get another Francine. Do a quick save here. Good. Foos! Smack him. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Jeez, you're so loud! Oh, shit. All right, again. We can do it, we can do it. Okay. Yeah, you can't get me through a block of stone, Foof. you dumbass. Oh, shit. <laughs> Neither can I. Here we are. Shh, Shazbot. Uh-oh, I'm dead. <laughs> oh, his supersonic scream. Okay, again. Let's see. Look at him go. What an anus. See, look, sometimes my bash does not take. Am I, like, holding down my left click too much? Look at the point-blank AoE tear this dude apart! Holy shit, it does so much! Hooray! We did it, Sven! Oh my gosh. Soloed that stuff. Well, also with the help of Francine, of course. Shoutouts to Francine. <laughs> Ooh, look at that powerful thing. All right. How much is that thing worth, even? Value to weight ratio is 20. And then on this... Dwarven Sword, 11. Yo, let's get that. Good. Okay. Very, very good. Anything else on these fellas? One unit of gold. I'll take it. Should I heal up? Yes, I should. Okay. I love it. Look, there might be some goodies down here just as well. Draugr, what have you got? Nothing of interest. Anything back here? Eh, it doesn't look like it. Oh, look. A little tiny alcove. Ooh. You'd think there would be some secret treasure there, but there is really not. Okay. Fair enough. Heal on up again. Oh, we're good. Whew, man, you know? Draugr ain't shit. We are tearing through them, aren't we? Falmer? They fuck us up. Charis, especially? Wow, that poison is fucking obliterating us. All those bandits? Whew, scary. Undead? <laughs> they ain't shit. Oh my god, they're like the weakest fucking thing. I fought bears with more power than you. <laughs> I almost said, I fought bears with more balls than you. <laughs> Look at Sven go, he's doing a, a victory dance. <laughs> Look at Sven go! Come on, Sven, dance! Yeah! Sven loves it! Sven loves to do battle with Draugr Menace dudes. Oh, uh, look at Sven. He loves it. <laughs> Sven, you're so cool. Did you learn that at the Bard College, you jackass? <laughs> look at him go. He's doing a little jig. Oh, <laughs> amazing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, no, yeah, that was the Dwarven Sword that we threw onto it. Right, right, right. I did that. 
Okay, have we checked all of these bots? I believe we have. All right? And there's no little fun secrets down below there. So let's head on up here and claim our big super prize. Ooh, yeah, I'm ready for it. What am I gonna get? Tell me another secret word. And we have like a dragon soul built up so we can easily get it, no problemo. Uh oh. Oh my gosh, look. Oh shit. But there's still a trap. Do you see? I do kind of like that, how it, it is likely that you'll spot it, especially in this version of the game, right? Where you can, where things are a bit more well lit, I think. Like there's more orangey yellows. Was that a sound of a dude? No, I don't think so. Okay. Is it something behind the hide shield? Oh yeah, it is right here. Okay, a novice trap. <laughs> Easy. Oh my gosh. Coin purse? Not bad. What have we got? Oh, 200 fucking quatloos and a big fucking piece of work here. Oh, hachi machi. Wow, it's very heavy though. Let's use this spell tome fear. Staff of courage. Target won't flee for 60 seconds and get some extra health and stamina. Huh. It weighs eight units. Hmm. I'm thinking we'll probably sell that off, because courage isn't exactly the most useful thing. Espe well, do we mind carrying around that in order to buff up Sven and maybe our Atronach every now and then? I'm not sure, because that's how we would use it. Hmm, something to consider. Should we take this Dwarven armor? 46 armor rating. What is our current... 42! And the warmth is off the charts. 54, where is this thing? 27. Dwarves be cold. Though I do love how it looks. Value to weight ratio is only 9. So maybe fuck it. Right, Sven? Maybe fuck it. Okay, let's check this. What should we ditch here? Eey. We have so much garbage. Do we have another piece of dragon shit? A mammoth tusk? I need to get rid of some dragon shit here, dude. Here's fine. Right behind you. Let's trade. What do you want me to carry? Okay. What all can you carry here, Sven? What do you enjoy? Do you have any dragon shit on you? Yes, you do. Maybe we get rid of the scales, right? Let's get rid of the scales. Okay, and there you can take this unit and this. Do you have anything here that Sven would like? I don't think so. Not in particular. There we are. Okay, good. And then we'll drop dragon trash. Eat on. Thunk. <laughs> I love that. Honestly, part of me wishes every time you drop stuff on the ground, even if it were like a little spoon. <laughs> Let's get that healing potion. Good. What's this? What is this? Oh, it's like a candle. A candlestick or something. Okay. Over here, what have we got? Hide bracers, leather armor. Coin purse. The one thing I do wish is when you were looking at armor here, it would actually tell you the warmth. I'm fairly certain leather armor is up there, right? As far as warmth is concerned. Or maybe I'm conflating that with fur, right? Fur armor definitely is, but I think so too is leather. All right. What's the word of the day? Ooh, tell me your secrets! Kind's Peace. What does it do? Oh. I, <laughs> I guess we don't know. Yeah, how do you like that, Sven? That's pretty cool, huh? You've seen that happen a few times. Oh shit, look at that. <gasps> There's treasure of pleasure. Oh shit, I don't know if I can reach. Oh, I definitely cannot do it that way. I might need my super dashing do. Huh. Oh, fuck. Can you not sprint jump? Am I tripping balls? Can you not do that? Yeah, you can't. Oh, fuck. Yeah, we can't get that shit then. Hmm. What is over there? Looks like a sack of gold and a dwarven sword. Great sword, I think. Okay. 
Oh, you know what? Let's try this. Foos! Oh, I, it was worth a shot. <laughs> okay, let's see. What does this thing do? Kind's peace. The voice soothes wild beasts who lose their desire to fight or flee. Huh. Weird. Okay, so I guess it's a decent enough way to, like, go after pelts and shit, I guess? I don't know if we should unlock it until we have another soul banked, right? I feel like there's better things. We'll see, because even worst case, if we find a scenario where we need to use it, we can just pop open our inventory and learn it on the spot, right? So while we're still kind of in need of more dragon souls... I think this is a good strategy. Thank goodness we don't have to do it when we sleep. <laughs> oh, treasure! Now this might actually be better of a treasure than what we saw in that little alcove. Oh, Shazbot. Alright, up here. Oh, shit. Okay. And like this. Damn, dude! Okay. Nailed it. Easy. <laughs> An elven shield. Hmm. Eh. I'll take the soul gem, though. Wait, how much carry weight do we have? We could probably actually... Yeah, we could take this. Let's do it. Worst case, we just drop it, right? Okay. Anything else around these parts? Ooh. I do not know. I should have actually checked the value to weight ratio on those dragon scales. Maybe we should have dropped something else. I don't know. It's just more fun to pick up other items in dragon scales because it feels more like finding treasure, you know? Okay, cool. Let's head on out. We did look behind this, didn't we? Sometimes there is a magical treasure behind. Yeah, I think we did. Let me just double check. I'm getting paranoid. Yeah, okay. We're good. Good, good, good. And over in this, is there another, like, partially buried bit of woot loot? Submerged, even? No, I think we're fine. I think we already found it. We found all that needed to be found. Okay, let's head on up and out. Thank goodness. Man, this place is titanic. Look how huge it all is. Even this room. Shit. Just clear out all of the fucking dead bodies from here and have everyone in the town in Iverstead live inside the fucking barrow. Jesus. <laughs> have all the dead bodies outside. Maybe they'll protect it against dragons and shit. Honestly, you know what? That's kind of a good idea. Yeah, shit. Get on that. Okay. What have we got? Is that stuff I can loot? No. Oh shit, did we get another bonus bit of loot loot here? Huh? Ugh. Oh my gosh. Whose colon is this? Ugh. Look at this little gnarly asshole. Oh shit, a steel warhammer. I doubt that's better than a dwarven one though. <laughs> oh look, hey, there is a little bit more treasure. Wow, a silver garnet ring. Yo, I'm taking that. That's dope. Let me out, let me out. Where are we? No way, it was right behind his fun zone? Right by his poop bucket! Wow, this dude would be hearing weird shit while he was pooping! Oh my god, what a dude. What a guy. Okay. Should we take any of this shit back? I don't know. <laughs> we could cook some stuff up here in the alchemy lab, right? Here, maybe we should do that real quick. Hmm. Do we have stuff for, like, healing potions? I'm not sure. Let's see, Sven, what do you Still have? Here. What do you want me to carry? Because we could always do our experimenting at, like, a proper town and all of that, right? Let's see. Yeah, we probably should wait, shouldn't we? Hmm. Because this will probably also increase our carry weight when we craft up potions. Oh, look, I haven't eaten jazz bake rice. Ah! Ow, fuck! Jesus. <laughs> For good reason, too. Man, they put that in booze? What the fuck? Tundra cotton. I just want to eat one. Huh, resist magic. White cap, it seems dangerous. Weakness to frost. Okay. Alright, good. 
You Let's lead, head out. I'll follow. There aren't like a whole bunch of new dudes in here, are there? I don't think so. Can we go tell everyone in town about the wild ass Barrow adventure we had? I hope so. Let's see. Look at these. Huh. How did they get these to stay dead? Maybe by making them completely naked? They get power when they have the more clothes that they wear? <laughs> Good lord, who knew that they were so into fashion? As it turns out, that's their source of power. <laughs> Let's head on out. There we are. Oh look, if you have an enchanted weapon equipped, its current enchantment level is shown above your stamina bar or magicka bar. Ah, uh, depending on what side you're wielding it. Alright. I really love the dual wield system, right? I hope they... I hope that it, it is present as well in Elder Scrolls 6. And in fact, I hope not only is it present, but it's built up upon, right? I feel like one of the shortcomings of it is that dual wielding two weapons, you lose a lot of fun functionality. Like, being able to block and like do block shoving and all that in melee adds so much more to melee combat. Whereas if you have two weapons like that, I mean, all you can do is just like sidestep. You go back to Oblivion Land. All right, let's see. Let's head on up in here. Villamir Inn. Hey everyone, well, Wilhelm. Oh my gosh, it's me again, Wilhelm. You. Don't you recognize me? me Guess what? I went on the wildest ass adventure. I went inside the Barrow. I killed all of your ancestors. Found all sorts of cool stuff. Friend. Now Let's that our see. ghost has been unmasked, oh. I hope we see more visitors in town than just the occasional pilgrim. <laughs> yeah, now that he's been unmasked, you mean I killed him? <laughs> That's right, Wilhelm. Wink. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Wilhelm, I didn't unmask him. I murdered him. <laughs> Though he did try to kill me. It was self-defense. Ten gold. Sure thing. It's yours for I'll a I'll take day. a room. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. Thanks, dude. Okay. Ugh. Not a fan of that. <laughs> Let me know if there's anything It's else always the head that bothers me, right? I don't mind the pelts and shit and, like, sleeping under that. That's not bad. It's the head. It's really the head that does it for me. All right. Let's see. Ooh. How about we just go... How long do you need to sleep to get, like, a full night's rest? I'm assuming it's eight hours, right? Let's do it. There we are. Oh, we'll have a level up as well. What should we pick? Ooh, we have so many choices. Let's see. I'm thinking maybe some health. That we could get stamina and that way our carry weight will be rounded up to 200 even, right? Yeah, let's do that. In the sake of having a nice flat 200, let's go with stamina. Okay. Can I pick anything cool here? And conjuration. Greater duration for that shit. Apprentice conjuration. Nope, not yet. We're getting close to it, though. How's my... Alteration? We got at least one point in that. Hmm. Because isn't alteration the one that gives us some kind of magic? Yeah, we want this. It's just 30% magic of resistance at all times. Very good. Okay, let's see. What else do we have that we have a lot in? Block here. Quick reflexes, time slowdown, able to do a power bash. We could pick that up. Our one-handed is really just going through the roof, but I feel like there's way better things to be picking. Like, we could get crafting shit, like alchemy. Can we yet go up there? No. We're still waiting. We still need to do another big alk off. Restoration, how do we look here? Isn't there some good passives in Restoration? Yeah, Magicka Regen. Ooh. Once a day, heal 250 points automatically if you fall below 10% health. That seems pretty useful. But at the same time, maybe if we fall below 10% health, we're dead already. Like, <laughs> what are the chances of us getting to that point and not dying instantly? Okay. Let's check out our enchants here. Soul gems provide extra magicka. We could check out smithing. Maybe this is a point where we just need to conserve it because we have a few like alchemy units built up. Maybe that's what we got to do. Or we could get heavy armor, right? Maybe we do that. That'll be useful. Hmm. Yeah, let's do it. 
Because when we do the all, all of our alchemy work, look, we're already nearly level 18. They'll probably level us up, so let's just get another point in Juggernaut. There we are. I think you should continue with your performances. <sighs> What's the point? You all were in here watching me I'm sleep? I'm not very good, and it's only for the same few people mm -hmm. every night. Hey, you all were in there watching me I sleep. I think you play beautifully. It would be a shame if you stopped. Oh, shit. All right, Wilhelm. I suppose it's the least I can do for you. Wait, these are free to take. Yeah, this isn't stealing. What? All of this is free now? Now that I helped them? Oh, look. Herbane's bestiary. Bestiary. Let's see. How much carry weight do I have? Yeah, 200. Let's take this. Wow. Everything is free now. This inn is great. Oh, my gosh. Everyone should come here. Oh, shit. He just vanished. Oh, God. Get many visitors through here. Look, he's got a poop Unless bucket down there. Up to high Hrothgar, of course. Okay. What other foods are here that... Oh, wow, I can just take all of this bread. Have you Pardon me, Sam. Bread? I'm gonna take all this shit. <laughs> no. I'll tell you, Wilhelm. If I could sweep her away from here tomorrow, I'd do it. But Klimek still has so much to learn. Klimek is... Pardon me, my lord. Potatoes here. I'm just gonna eat them. Would you care to hear me play my lute? No, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm on a... Perhaps one I'm on day, a hungry hunt. But not... I'm hunting for food. Day. There we are. I'm a little peckish. Wow, salt pile, raw beef? Yo, this place is stocked. Carrots, oh, I need them. Now I think I just need leeks, don't I? Let's take all these for our big alchemy need a room, zone. maybe a drink, you name it. Let's see, let's take these, because honestly, these are very weight efficient. Let's just harvest all of them. Poor little fellas. Probably smells like shit, Let you know? Let me know if I can get you anything. Here we are. Oh, pheasant. There it is. Okay, good. Should we take some of this booze? We could just get fucking blasted. Yeah, let's do that. Let's drink all of that. There we are. I love this fucking place! <laughs> there we are. Cool! Wow! This place fucking owns! Let's get some of these as well. A pine thrush egg? I don't even know what the fuck that is. Should I eat it? Probably. You look like someone who can hold Holy shit! Liquor. It's all free! Let's see. Maybe we can get through this with just, like, eating weird shit that we found. Okay, salmon steak. I should reserve that. Carrots. Content. Oh, bread. Bread. We can't cook bread into anything. To win a there staff. we are. Good. Let's see. Take more booze. More bread. Wow, this place is fantastic! It's all free! Truly the hero's welcome we've been waiting for. There we are. Holy shit, look, more free stuff. Wow, helping people pays I think off. You should continue with your performance. Okay, and then let's get fucking blasted again. There we are, eat all this bread. We're satisfied. Lord mead. What's Consume the point? like a million units of that. I'm not very all good, this bread. <gasps> are we well fed yet? No, I don't think so. More booze, please! <laughs> this is awesome! There we are. Cool! Finally, I'm well fed. I just had to eat I every single fucking thing in here. <laughs> Almost. It would be a shame if you stopped. Awesome! All right, okay. Oh, look. I suppose Chicken's the egg. Least I can do for you. Let's head over here. We can sneak into that other person's house and do some cooking, can't we? Before we head out. Let's see. Do they mind? Klimek's house? Yeah, Klimek ain't home, right? Klimek don't care. Oh shit, someone does see me, though. Here we are. Good. That Shazbot. Okay. We need their house key, is what we need. Cool. Knock, knock. Anybody home? Nope. Alright, Sven, this is it. Give me some of that salt, I've dude. got your back. Let's trade. What do you want me to carry? I want to carry some of your shit, actually. Let's see. I need salt pile. There we go. I'll take all of it, and I'll just cook up all this. You lead, I'll follow. Dope. Okay, beef stew. What does this use? Hmm. Oh, hey, beef, beef stew is actually all right. 
Look, it also restores two points of stamina per unit. Or per whatever second. Yeah. Okay. Let's make beef stew, I think. Okay. Rad. What else do we need for beef stew? Garlic. I think there's some sitting on the table right over there. We'll make this pheasant roast. And rabbit haunch. Here we are. So there's one unit of garlic. Good. Okay, cool. Let's do some cooking again. And beef stew, yo! I love it! Awesome. Okay, here's Sven. Let's leave. Actually, yeah, let's leave first. <laughs> that way they don't run in and be like, Who's cooking in my stew pot? There we are. Okay, right behind Sven? You. Take some of this shit. What do you want me to carry? And let's see here. Take some. Ooh, fuck! I don't even know. We got so much here. Take all these crafting ingredients, right? Take all my reagents. Good. Okay. We could hand off. Ooh. Will Sven start eating food? He might start eating my food. So maybe fuck that. Maybe don't give it to him, right? Hmm. Okay. You know what? We'll give you this book. That's one that we read. How about Notes on the Lunar Forge? There you go. Third Era Timeline. Great. There we are. Okay. <laughs> you lead, I'll follow. Good shit. Now. Let's see. What was that other quest? We had to go hunt down... Yeah, locate Raida's remains. Where is that at? Let's see. Over there. How far is that? Oh, that's very nearby. Let's check it out. Why not? Here we go. Maybe Narfi will let us in on some kind of cool-ass secret. Look, it must be that... Oh, no, it's in the water right here. Oh, Jesus. Using our Dragonborn senses, we can just automatically detect where it's at. Or sorry, our prisoner senses. <laughs> okay. Wow, you have glow dust on you. I'm eating it. Ow, it sucks. Hag Raven Claw? I'm eating that too. Resist magic? I'm eating this. Cure disease? Whoa. Take this. A river Betty. And your necklace. <laughs> Ooh! <laughs> Okay. Let's head over to Narfi. Poor fucking Narfi. Here we are. Do a quick save just as well. Look at this. I keep thinking it's some sort of ore. Leaf ore. Hey, Narfi. Bad news, dude. But I feel like you should know. Oh, Raider, Raider. You live among the clouds now, dear Raider. He's got the loop in the third haircut. <laughs> I miss Rada. She was so nice to Narfi. Narfi's sad he can't be with Rada. Sorry, Narfi. She's dead. I found Rada's necklace. She said she'll be home soon. I found the necklace. Rada! You saw Rada? Did you tell her Narfi cries? Did you tell her Narfi never said goodbye like mother and father? Sorry, Narfi. She's dead. Oh, no. No, no, no! Narfi never got to say goodbye. Now Narfi's all alone. At least Narfi has Raida's necklace. Reminds Narfi of his sister. Thank you for giving this to Narfi. Poor fucking Narfi. Whoa, he gave me human flesh? Fire salts, though. Yo! Man, I don't mind the human flesh. I'll take that fire salt. Holy shit. That's the good shit. Wow, our first fire salts is a gift from Narfi. Who would have thought? Man, okay, Narfi, I was about to say, you're free to come down to, uh, what is it, <laughs> Bree's home or whatever, I don't mind if you hang out there, I'm hardly there most of the time, but he did give me some human flesh as a reward, so I don't know if I want him there now, if he's going to eat people. <laughs> Narfi, are you eating people or did you just find this? <laughs> Because that is a very important distinction for me at the moment. <laughs> okay. I think we should begin our fantastic trek out. Or we could check out this, Garamoon's Hall. I'm not sure. 
We could make way for Riften, right? We could do that. Ooh, look, Lost Tongue Overlook. Yeah, let's make our way for Riften. All right, let's head on over there. Hopefully we run into nothing along the road. And it's just a nice, peaceful jaunt over to Riften Land, right? <laughs> Unlikely, but I'm hopeful. <laughs> I'm optimistic. We'll see. If we can get there, we'll call it on the exterior, on the perimeter, and then when we come back... Oh, look. Oh, I love that. I love this. Ugh. Flutter by, butterfly. There we are. Oh, beautiful, wonderful. Okay. But yeah, <laughs> when we got distracted by butterflies. When we get there, we'll probably call it. So that way we can just fully explore all of Riften in the next one, right? And hopefully this goes smoothly, right? Oh god. It's looking like it's really not going to go smoothly. Oh right, this is the bear zone. Okay, Riften over this way. Fuck, is that a mother- Oh no! Jeez! <laughs> oh god. Is there cover out here? Yes there is. Oh fuck! Don't look at me! There we go. Okay. Here we are. Let's go in. Oh, you ass. Good shit. Okay. Another fucking frost dragon, huh? Just my fucking luck. Okay. Let's get poison applied. Let's recharge our weapon here. Let's see. Let's use Lesser Soul. There we are. Do I have any others that won't super fill it up? Yeah, great. Okay. Let's get Resist Frost. There we go. And let's not fuck around. We got Beef Stew? I'm beefing up, baby. Give me that Beef Stew. Okay. And then, because we already know Unrelenting Force has limited interaction Whoa. there. Do it. Okay, great. Let's apply more poison. There we are. Good. More venom. Great. Okay, we need more poison. What else do I have? How about... Paralysis Lingering Poison. That seems dope. Good. Apply that shit. Okay, another weak poison there. Let's get it. Let's run over to this rock. Yo, where have you gone? Okay, good. Let's get him. Eat shit, dude. Oh, no! One shot from Max Health! Oh my god, what a power move. Holy shit. One shot from max full health. Oh fuck. Sven, it's up to you. Oh. <laughs> Do this. Oh god. This is dangerous as hell, man. <laughs> he can one shot me. What? Oh, I'm not at max health. My bad. My bad, my bad, my bad. We need to get out of one-shot range. <laughs> okay, over here. Good. Not on me. I love it. Oh, why won't you get interrupted, you piece of shit? All right, good. Let's go back over to the cover. Good thing it lands here a shitload. I say that as it decides not to land. Am I safe? Ah! No, I'm not. Ooh. Shit, yo, who is this? It's Archer Arnold. He's here to save me. All right. Oh, no, it didn't interrupt him. Oh, you motherfuck. Let's get go back. Wow, what a creepy load screen. Oh, shit. I'm right back in the fuck zone. Oh no! I'm in the fuck zone! 
Oh, shit! Oh, fuck. Oh, man, it did not want to fuck me last time like this. Okay. Oh, Shazbot. All right, we're in the death time. Okay, let's get healing. We have to blow this. Oh, fuck. Okay, we're fine now. Where is it? Okay, we're fine. Let's save. Whoa, shit! Oh my god, are we not? I didn't think it, it would do a fucking drive-by on me. Oh, shit! Wow, this is the worst fucking day of my life! All right. Oh, more healing! Okay, now we're safe. <laughs> what the fuck? You motherfucker! Oh well, look, there's armor here. <laughs> Let's get some magic, right? Aversion to Magicka. No, I would love to have... Ooh, look at this. Decrease the target's Magicka regen. Oh, but it increases their health. We just need to sell that. <laughs> Where are my Magicka potions? There's one. Let's get another one. F it. Okay. Here. Great. Interrupt. Eat shit, dude. Ugh. Come on. Oh god. Interrupted. Great. Remember what I said about getting levels? <laughs> Here it is. Eat a butt. Oh my god, we're doing great. Yes! Eat a butt, dude! Oh, fuck yeah! Where did it come from? Oh, look at it wiggle around. Wiggle around, you fuck. Oh, yes. <laughs> Behold my power, Archer Arnold! <laughs> oh, I'm toasty as hell! Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Sing for me, ancients of Sovngarde. Woo! <laughs> your power! Lend me your power! <laughs> what have you got? Oh, fuck. <laughs> what a dick. Let's take some of that. Let's see. Sven, here. how much room you got? What do you Let's want see. me to carry? Can you carry any of this, Sven? Because we are in a... Encumbrance conundrum. No, you can't. Okay, fair enough. We're just gonna have to. I'll follow. I'll take it, and then I'll drop it. Okay, items, and maybe we'll find it someday, right? Maybe we'll fucking find it someday. There we are. Oh, look. Hey. What the fuck? You trying to get- You left this over there. You're lucky. Someone else might have kept it for himself. Here you go. I don't want it. You asshole. <laughs> All right. What's up? Waiting. Insufferable waiting. Look at that thing's head, dude. What are you waiting for? Okay, dude. I'm trying to... I'm trying to get rid of this. <laughs> get away from me, dude. <laughs> Get away from me, you freak! I'm trying to get rid of a dragon bone! Let's see. If I enter stealth... Shit. <laughs> okay, perfect. Now. Thank God. <laughs> what a fucking dude. Okay. <sighs> Let's see. What's in this? It's a wolf pelt. Great. Huh. Wasn't there a book or something over here that we saw? And like some elven armor? Yeah, elven armor. Where'd that book go? Journey Brett's Last Dance. Oh. We'll take that. Don't mind if I do. All right. Great. <laughs> How far are we from Riften? Fuck, we're still fucking far away. All right, you know what? At this crossroads when we have just slain a dragon, good time as any. <laughs> Fuck, we, we owned that dragon real quick, and we just had the help of, like, 
uh, Archer Arnold for just like half of it or what, right? Man, we're getting up there. We're starting to kick some ass, huh? All right. Well, when next we come back, we will continue toward Riften. Good Lord, it's taken for fucking ever, but we might finally fucking do it. We might finally get to fucking Riften after all this. Whew. But, of course, if you'd like to stick around, we will be doing a little bit of reading. And what is that reading today? Let's see. How about... Let me check my list here in real life. Let's read Ingol and the Sea Ghosts. Let's see. What have... What a tale is this? Or <laughs> yeah, what kind of tale is this, I should say? Let me take a drink here in real life as well. Pardon me. Okay. Ingol and the Sea Ghosts. Maser and Secunda passed over Yisgramor's people as their fellowship landed in longboats upon the rocky shores of Sarik Head. On their journey from Atmora to Merith, boats littered the coast, but Ysgrimor did not count his kin, Ingol's among them. Ysgrimor commanded the sea ghost to surrender his kin, and a great gale darkened the sky. The seas thrashed and churned, and a wrathful storm appeared. Ysgrimor took up the oars and rowed into the storm alone. Upon the sea, Ysgrimor wrestled the sea ghosts, and the storm carried him along the jagged coast. Two fortnights passed without relief, until finally the storm broke. Come the next dawn, Ingol's longboat was found in the icy surf, but the vengeful sea ghosts had already taken Ingol and his clansmen. In his terrible grief, Isgrimor slew a dozen dozen beasts and burned them in honor of his fallen kinsmen. A barrow hill was dug in the Atmoran tradition, and Yingol was laid to rest with rites and honors among his clansmen far below the rocky face of Sarik, of Sarik Head, the first children of the sky to perish in Tamriel. Oh, very short. Huh. So I wonder if this, this is why it's called the Sea of Ghosts. Is it named after this? Of, after this event or this tale? Maybe. Hmm. Because isn't the Sea of Ghosts... Hmm, no, the Sea of Ghosts is between Morrowind and... Like, mainland Morrowind and Vardenfell, isn't it? I think? Maybe? Though, of course, they very well could have sailed through it on their way to modern-day Skyrim, and they may have made landfall there, right? Yeah. Did, um... How does the timeline work exactly? Did did the Nords set sail from Atmora and make landfall in Tamriel before the Chimer had uh, at left, went on pilgrimage to Morrowind from Somerset? Did did Morrowind get populated by Dunmer or Chimer before Atmora Atmorans came to Tamriel? Hmm. I'm not sure. Right? I think it was... I think the Admorans were in mainland Morrowind and Skyrim areas beforehand, right? Because wasn't that the whole idea behind the warring between the Dunmer and the Nords? Right? Because the Nords went there. I, I forget why they even went there. Was it also some sort of strange prophecy or, like, deity told them to do that? Maybe? But nonetheless, the idea was that the, the Chimer went there because of... Ooh, why did they go there? It was some sort of divine calling. They saw it as like a holy land, right? Yeah. It was some sort of... If They saw Morrowind as a holy place, and they went there, and they refused to leave. And that friction of them not wanting to leave because they saw it as some sort of holy land, and Atmoran's Nords were already there from Atmora. Right? Yeah, so that, like, conflict over the land, I guess. Hmm. Did Nord see Morrowind as, like, some sort of holy place, or was it just because they were there beforehand and they were upset that the Chimer wanted to drive them out? Because even the Chimer weren't there beforehand, right? The dwarves were. Dwarves were originally in Morrowind area. 
Hmm. Right? And where were... How did the dwarves combat with... In the war between... Dunmer and Nords? Which side were the... Were the dwarves on? Weren't they on the side of... The Keimer slash Dunmer? I can't remember. Maybe they were on both sides. Like, at one point, they were on the side of... Of fellow elves, right? Fellow Mur. And then at another point, the Nords teamed up with the, the Dwemer to drive out the now deeply rooted Dunmer. And then that that conflict was the one that resulted in the dwarves disappearing. I can't remember. Need a timeline or something. <laughs> if only that timeline book was a little bit more <laughs> was better. <laughs> If only it were better. <laughs> oh, gosh, if you want a good timeline, fucking UESP has one, I believe, right? Look at this fucking dead-ass dragon wiggling around. Look at that. All right, when next we come back, Riften, I hope. And who knows? I mean, when next we come back, this dragon will have, like, wiggled all the way into the sky and be sent over to <laughs> High Hrothgar or some shit. What the fuck? <laughs> it's just gonna start flipping all over the damn place and fly right up there. <laughs> Until next time, please take care of each other.